Lower, 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 yeah, yeah, there you go, pull up, pull up. Alright, so one of my friends contacted me because he was flying his DJI Mavic 3 and he crashed on the mountain. It's class year airspace over there, so we're good to fly there. But, he can't get the drone back because it's in a very sketchy area. We, we can't climb down there and he can't just get a fishing rope or whatever and go try to get the drone. So, he contacted me asking if we could retrieve it. I was like, I got you. So, we came up with a quick plan. We 3D printed a hook and we're going to hopefully pray that this works. Because if, if not, that means there's going to be two drones stuck over there. Actually three because <laughs> there's going to be a whoop on top of the 5 inch. For LP. We'll, we'll describe it when we get more over there, but yeah. We're going to end up losing two drones if this is not working. Last week, I'm pretty sure it'll be in the same spot. I mean, it's pretty well in there, so I don't think like the weather or anything will have taken it down. Yeah, it hasn't rained, so we're fine. Yeah. Well, she needs it. Yeah. All right, so first battery is gonna be locating it. The second two batteries are going to be. There's only two batteries. Trying. There's only two batteries. <laughs> yeah. Oh. That's why. First battery. Hopefully, we're gonna try our best to find it. Second battery is just go for it, send it. Full on send, like even if the drone crashes, we're gonna send it. So where are the drone? Where is the drone at? Should be just right up here, right? At the top, but as soon as it kind of comes down. So actually, here's a good clue. When you get up there, you see the red flag? Mm -hmm. There's gonna be stepping stones coming down to where it is. And so at the end of those oh, yeah, stones, it's gonna be right in the little crevice right there. All right. All right, so we're gonna go ahead and set up for the shot. And thankfully we have this new drone, what is it, eight foot freaking landing pad? Oh, come on. That was a big fail. <laughs> Dude, this thing is huge. <laughs> Bro, this is insane. I can't believe we're going, just doing this right now. All right, a battery strapped on top of another battery. And then as soon as we take off, boom, the hook. Kelvin said, so the boss of Nibi drone was like, all right, yes, let's come up with the hook. So we did. <laughs> All right, take it off. Yeah, I see the red flag. So I'm right in front of it right now. I'm right in front of the red flag. Oh yeah, that's right there, I see it. Alright, just tell me if the hook is close. I see, I see the drone. Yeah, okay, let me just see, let me see, if, uh, so the next battery I can just get right to it. Alright, coming back. Coming back. It's hard to do with just licking out of the FTV. All right, stand closer to me so okay, I can look so at. Oh, what are what are we doing here? So obviously I couldn't do it with the FTV. I'm gonna need you to just hold this. There's a camera on the bottom. We'll show it in the end, by the way. Let's take off. It's crazy. It's crazy. That's right there. You see it? You yeah. see it to your left. My left. It's to right. your left. All right, now you're gonna have to guide me. Then. Keep going slower, lower, lower. Right there. So you're right there. Keep. You passed it. Don't pass that. All right. Yeah. Okay. okay. So go slow. Right there. You're you're directly under it now. Okay. Right there. Oh, I see what you're talking about. Damn, all right, Steady, hard. steady. I'm trying to be as steady as possible. Am I over it? Yeah, yeah, just go down lower. Alright, down lower. And, uh... uh... 
I do. No, I don't see the ground. I see it's right there, it's right there. Right under, right under. Right under. Keep going down. Yeah, yeah. You almost had it. Pull up. It's hard. It, you just keep swinging. That's the hard part about it. It's fine. Just go all the way down. Try to touch the ground. There you go. Okay, so you're gonna have to do that what you just did. Just fall. I'm flying back. As, as soon as you're right over it, just let the drone drop a little bit. You have to guide me because I can't see. I'm flying at TV through the monitor. Right there. Low, low, low. Right there. Lower, 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 lower. Yeah. yeah, there you go. Pull up, pull up. There you go. Got it. <laughs> Let's go. I got it? Yeah, you, you got, got it. it. You got it. Come on down. Just lie in the it. There you go. Go slow, go slow. Go slow, go slow. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> oh, grab. Oh, grab. Oh, grab. That's good. That's good. <laughs> Best case scenario. <laughs> oh, <fuck you. laughs> no way! No freaking way! <laughs> <laughs> I just only one piece for that. <laughs> Let's go! Wow. Bro, for the people that call me a bad pilot, they're, okay, that's gotta freaking like top it off, man. Wow. Incredible. It doesn't seem too bad. No. I think you just blow off the air you know? inside your house. Totally. I am Not. thoroughly impressed. I. Thought there might be a way that we tap it and it fall down, but I didn't expect to pick it up. I really thought we were gonna pick it up either. Uh, that is impressive. Honestly, man. I think you might still be able to fly it. Anyway. Yeah, I mean it's worth a shot. It's a viral clip. Right shot. I always just send it. Yo. They replace it. I have coverage, and they just. Oh yeah, it. do that. Do that. Hundred yeah. percent. So this was the setup, guys. We had the digital camera here pointing down because we want that HD crispy footage. Uh, to be able to, to be able to see the hook. So as I was fl uh, as I was flying, I was seeing out of this the t the race spec too. So hopefully we get more cells on that, guys. <laughs> but I was looking out of the race spec, uh, as you guys can see. And then as he was wearing the goggles and holding my phone, I was kind of looking at it too. I was I was looking between the Nubidron monitor and my phone at both. And as as soon as I saw it, I was mainly focused on this because I didn't want to run into the cliff. So as he told me to go down because he was looking too with this camera. We hooked it on as you guys saw in the video and then I just flew away and I felt the drone because of the center of the gravity just it went from here to all the way down here. So I felt the drone moving and I was like I'm, I'm just gonna go left and just bring it towards us and if it crashes on sand it's not that bad because it's, it's a soft impact and obviously we can just blow it out with some air. So that's what exactly what happened. The filmer uh, for Nubi Drone, Alex, so he designed this in like less than 24 hours we 3D printed it and then we got the filament from TPU. <laughs> and then we just hooked it on like that because we didn't want to buy fishing line and yeah this this turned out to be much more efficient and better and it didn't break and it's actually dude it's pretty strong honestly i think it'll be stronger than the fishing line so yeah great success guys we made it drones back we got both drones and we're all gonna split up a hundred bucks so good payday for us <laughs> that's still pretty crazy all right guys so hopefully you guys enjoyed this video i know it was kind of a random day that my friend just hit me up about that but again this is really fun as you guys saw we use nubidrone products so check out the nubidrone store you guys can buy the race specs the smooth motors or the nubidrone's aio just let us know down below what you guys like and what, what kind of more content you guys want to see you guys can probably do similar stuff like this just be very safe out there all right so don't forget to like comment share, subscribe nubidrone team out